Kinesthetic learning is particularly effective because it engages the whole body and it engages all of the senses so the children are not just learning with their heads, they're learning with their entire beings. And so there's an opportunity there for learning to happen on a visceral level that is more complete and is retained for longer than if it's just an abstract idea in your head. With one class, we brought the children out and had them measure the beds to determine the square footage of the beds and then measure the amount of space that a full-grown plant would need to live. They then determined, through doing math calculations, how many of those plants could live in the particular bed that they had measured. Subsequently, we went ahead and planted the bed with the number of plants that the children determined was appropriate and they got to see whether in fact those plants were crowded or too spaced out or what exactly happened. Um, so it put math in the context of real life. Math is a language and therefore is often very abstract for children. And for children who are not abstract thinkers, it can be a difficult and tedious subject. When we bring math out into the garden, children have an opportunity to be involved with math in the real world with things that matter to them and they're connected with. You gotta shake the dirt and the water 50 times one person and 50 times another. And how many is that if you shake it 50 times plus 50 more times? How many times will that be? What will that be? It'll be 100 shakes. The reason to have a garden as opposed to just an outdoor space is that a garden is an intentional environment where children are welcome to be part of a community and to affect what's going on there. So given the fact that a garden is full of science, botany and soil science and the weather, the fact that it allows children to come in and interact with those elements and to learn from their interactions is a powerful motivator for getting their academic subjects inside of themselves where they can reside and live. <laughs>